We're at the equator. <laughs> All right. so, so what's your name? Gabriel. It's Gabriel. He's the assistant professor. <laughs> and my name is Samuel. 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 And pleasure to meet you all. And we are going to show you the demonstration to prove that this is the equator line. So pick one here. It's a hard job and a good thing. <laughs> good? <laughs> <laughs> so this is the northern hemisphere. That's the southern hemisphere. So if you move from here to the north of the equator, for the water to this bowl, the water will spin clockwise. When you go to the southern part, 20 meters again, the water will spin anti-clockwise. And when you come to the line, then the water will stand still. And this is the effect of Coriolis, which was discovered by Gaspar Coriolis. So we are going to start to the north, then go to the south, finish on the line. My assistant professor, I, I have hippo, <laughs> elephant, and reno. Which one would you like? We have what? Pick an elephant. Elephant. Pick an elephant. Because you're on a vacation and you've got a job, you have to get a person. Oh, not the elephant. She is going to get a happy elephant for good luck. That's free, no charge. So after that, I normally issue the certificates for you to prove that you crossed the equator. This is after and when you're qualified that you crossed the equator. So taking photo, video is free. Please, let's go 30 meters north. The middle of that hole, because if you pour the water aside and aside, that's pushing the water to go and that's not correct. Assistant, put the stick flat on top of water. Good job, assistant. <laughs> so I may try to so spin it So it's going it back. clockwise. It's going clockwise. How come she didn't light the match? <laughs> <laughs> oh. The same case as the climbing plants. In the northern part of Equator, it tends to coil in a clockwise motion. In the southern part, anti-clockwise. Also, the flashing toilets in the northern part of Equator, when it flash, spins clockwise. In the southern part, anti-clockwise. In the middle, it goes straight down. <sighs> Sounds good? Wow. Sounds good. Let's go and see the southern hemisphere, please. Assistant, thank you. <laughs> yeah, Trustee Assistant? Close in, close in. Um, the U.S.? You're all from the States? Yes. No. We're Canadian. Oh, yeah. Mm. <laughs> so, <laughs> Canada yeah, yeah. is North of America. <laughs> right. Yes. Yeah. Good. Very good. So, let's go ahead with the demonstration. Put the water again in the middle. So, is it your first time, Kenya? Yes. Yes, yes it is. How do you like it? Good? Oh, it's Love wonderful. It. Assistant? Uh -huh. Oh, my goodness. And it also goes slower in the south. Well, <laughs> I'll explain, more, right I'll explain <laughs> more about that. <laughs> You'll explain more about that. <laughs> so actually when you move from here, a few meters ahead, the water spins very fast. And between the sign and here, the water moves slowly. The Maasai who have been living on Ikita line, they have been using this like compass to know their direction. Once they want to go to the northern hemisphere, they pour the water and see the water is standing anti-clockwise, they say no, our home should be the other side. If they see the water stand still, they normally look the sun. The sun always starts from east to west, and then you can get direction to go. Any questions so far? Yeah. Let's get to the line, please. Very good. Assistant almost to get your present. <laughs> <laughs> Assistant, it's your chance. I think this one needs a drum roll. <laughs> da -da -da -da. Mm. I have to turn it round and see. Oh, wow. wow. <laughs> this is because the northern part and the southern part, the forces are equal. So we come to the neutral and that's the equator line. And that marks the end of my demonstration. And I wish you all good luck for the rest of your tour. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yay. So after that, as I said, we got the certificates to prove that you crossed the equator. This is where to put the name, the date. This is Samuel, that's me. Okay. In case of any question about the equator, that's my email, my address. Write back to me. I'll answer your question according to the line. Very so nice. I know my charge only 400 shillings, please. And after that, I do request you kindly to see my small okay. shop. Looking is free, no hassle. If somebody pushes you, please let me know. <laughs>